I'm going to need you to go and repair this toilet. This will get her points up anyway. Like, she's already almost as good as Pineappleina was, and she had a lifetime of toilet fixing. Repair this one as well. Can we ghost proof them? That's what I'd like to do. If we could ghost proof all the appliances. Scooter! Scooter! No! No! You're oh wait, he's just chatting. I thought he was going to kick her out to use the toilet or something. Um, see, that would really annoy me. Let's repair these ones as well. Look at this, so many fixed appliances. Well, not appliances, utilities, I guess. I get, yeah, that's what you'd call them, isn't it? Rather than appliances. Um, plumbing appliances, maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure what the technical word is. What What is a toilet a set of? Like, what, what is the set that toilets belong to, if, if not appliances? Uh, okay, let's clean up all this place. Um, I don't need you to do this, Appleella. Clean up all that rubbish. I know, look, she's miserable, but it's her own fault. What's going on here? Did Connor the Seventh just like pull that hot dog out of the microwave that's full of old crap? That's not very healthy. Um, oh, she's really tired. I guess bedtime next? I don't know. I was hoping she could fit in a game of chess or something, you know, fill up her social and her fun meters, but um, doesn't look like it's going to be. Appleella is still cleaning away. Not doing a great job, but... I know. Look at all these plates. Appleella, when you're done there, clean up the kitchen. I miss coconuts. Coconuts used to do things. Well, he, he also did things like sleep in the wrong bed, which eventually cost him his life. So, he's not really the best example of how to live your sim life, but... At least he was reliable on doing the dishes, you know? He did not He did it without complaint. Because the sink wasn't bugged back then. Well, if we can at least gather them all into one... Look, she's just not doing it. Go on, go on. Oh, oh, what? Needs failure. God, Appleella. God. So you're a little tired. No excuse. Um, but when she wakes up, she can clean up. Go on. She's just not doing it. Clean up these. Oh, fine. Go to sleep for a while then. My God, what do I need to do to get good servants around here? This is this is ridiculous. Connor the Sixth, uh, why do you have a little house there? Where are you? Oh my God, where is she? Uh, come home. She's not in work, is she? No, she's working four hours, though. And she's only got 50% of her daily meanness done. This is very, very um, worrying. Okay, go give this guy a rude introduction, quickly. We need to get the daily meanness done, at the very least. Okay. Um, let's rile him up. and mock his outfit oh come on come on hurry up oh she's not gonna she's not gonna make it into work she she won't get this done on time 75 percent done okay we're nearly there um oh no don't tell him to go away actually um insult him and rile him up there we go or no, rile up, I don't think, re I don't, I'm not sure if that counts, because it's a hot-headed thing. Brush him off. Oh no, wait, that's enough, that's enough. Perfect, okay, we've still got two hours until work. She's kind of really hungry, and kind of needs a shower, but... Forget him, look. Observe the skies, quickly. I don't know where she disappeared to for all that time. That was just really, really weird. It's like she wandered off the lot. Stargaze, quickly. 
How long have we got? 31 minutes. She's uncomfortable because she's so unclean. Um, can we get an aspiration reward for that? Something... Like, she already has Hardly Hungry. I don't know why she needs to eat. But apparently she does. Um... Oh, speed cleaner, gym rat, great storyteller, always welcome, sleep replacement. There's no food replacement. Instant hygiene, actually. That's going to be a good one. Um, Because, yeah. She is getting a little bit stinky there. Okay, take that instant hygiene. And you can stargaze a little longer and then go to work, maybe. She's still not focused. Um, okay, just just go to work. Go to work. Go to work. Abandon plan. Okay, as long as she works normally, I think she'll be okay. Yeah, it's, it's still going upward. Even though she's uncomfortable, she's hungry... It's just a bad day at work. She went fine for a while. Okay, perfect. She's going to get promoted as long as she doesn't screw up. That's... Okay, that is a pretty big as long as, but... We'll see. Oh, she's been promoted to getaway driver and... Sent home already, apparently. For what? For being too tired? Um... You know what? I'll take it. We got a lot of money from it. Uh, she... She's earning 273 an hour. She's got a few days off. She's got a, some bars of gold again. So let, let's just go with it. Let's not argue. It's time for bed. I guess her work hours must have been really, really short or something in her last promotion. Are they as short now? Like, what's her work day? Uh, 8 p.m. till 3 a.m. That's certainly not how long she was away before. Okay. Connor the seventh, get up. It's time for you to have some breakfast. You must break your fast with a serving of pancakes. Oh, 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 look who's awake. Look who's awake and should be cleaning up the kitchen. Come on, Appleella. Come on, prove your prove your worth. Appleella, I I asked you to clean up the kitchen. Let's see, can Anastasia do it? I'm gonna make sure it's not a bug before I start drowning people. But, um, I'm very annoyed. Anastasia, clean up. No, Anastasia's not cleaning up either. Okay, it's a bug. Apparently, they can't clean up the kitchen themselves anymore. Which is a pretty annoying bug, to be honest. It's. What can be so hard about making Sims wash dishes? I mean,. Surely that's one of the basic things they should test when they're, like, making a Sims game. Can Sims actually wash it? What What are you doing, Connor the Seventh? I told you to take a serving from the fridge. Oh, my God. Why are you cooking something else? Fussy eaters. My God. They're just, they're just wasting our food. I just, I get annoyed when they do that. When they, we already have decent enough food for them and they just they just are ungrateful they don't take it they throw all my uh, good deeds back in my face like some bowl of rancid yogurt which is ironically what I'm going to make them eat next time they do this I should just leave some yogurt out in the sun or something turn it proper cheesy for them um, so they can spread it on a sandwich <laughs> That would be interesting, wouldn't it? Yogurt spread. Because you have cheese spread. And you have butter. So why not yogurt spread? Is there a good answer for that? I mean, a, a strawberry yogurt sandwich? That could be good. It would be, uh, okay, the, it would probably so soak into the bread and make it really mushy and sticky and unedible. But... You could put ham in as well. Like a layer of ham, a layer of yogurt, then another layer of ham, just between some bread. Like you have a parcel of 
yogurt filled ham in the middle I think yeah there could be something I suppose if you're using ham you can't like use regular yogurt you'd have to use something that goes well with meat like uh, cranberry yogurt is there, is there cranberry yogurt there's another question I don't think I've ever seen one a cranberry yogurt I could be wrong but I don't think it's a thing let's make a shelf if you've ever had cranberry yogurt, let me know. Let me know where you get them, because uh, it sounds interesting. It would give your um, excretory system a good clean out as well. Because isn't that what cranberry does? It like it's good for your peeing. It uh, helps you pee more cleanly. I better get Anastasia to resume this painting. I'm not sure if she missed a day of work or what. Her performance is quite low. She's been working 24 hours. She's uncomfortable in this room because someone spilt crap on the floor. So let's get uh, Apollella to clean it up. Didn't I put more jars on top of the fireplace? I was 90% sure I did. Um, or did I put them in a different room? No, no, let me get a look at the family inventory because we, we had more jars. I'm sure of it. Um... Oh look, big pile of gold, bar stool. Oh, I don't see them. But no, where where did they go? I put them somewhere else in the house. I I wouldn't have, would I? I'm gonna to have to look this up. I'm gonna to have to replay old videos and just see exactly what happened to the alien jars. Cause yeah, there were definitely three of them. Because I was really excited when I found the other two. Unless I dreamed that. Did did I dream it? I don't really feel like watching old videos. I mean, if you guys can do it for me and tell me, then that would probably be handier. You know, because I'm lazy. But we'll see. Oh, let's make something more. Let, let's make a sculpture. No, 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 no. Make me a bunny sculpture. There we go. Starting with the... A block of wood and she will chip away at it like a lawyer chips away at the enemies of truth to reveal the golden bunny rabbit of lawfulness which is stored within um Connor the sixth is pretty well rested i think she should get up and have breakfast she doesn't have work for four days oh my god i wish i had that kind of job where i didn't have to go in for four days at a time that very, very rarely happens. It'll be good, though. That'd be the life. The life of a criminal. That's what she has. That's what I want. I want to be a criminal. What's she carrying here? A knife block. It doesn't look like a knife block. It looks like a pile of wood chips. Like, what the hell? That's not a knife block. Um, Where are you going, Connor the Seventh? Oh, she's going to the toilet. Okay, I, I'll allow that. You may urinate. If you wish. Oh, someone's laughing at my joke. Oh, look who it is. It's Apollella. Just messing around on the computer. When there's, like, business to do. Somewhere, I'm sure. There's always something to do in this house. Um... Like, standing out here in the middle of the road. There we go. Uh, let's see. Connor the seventh. Where are you? She's on the computer now. Now get off the computer. There's enough. There's enough time spent on the computer here. Now I know how my parents felt when I was younger. Um, I need you to repair the jukebox. What's this? Has she made a friend? Deep connection from socialization. I don't know who it's with. She must have made a friend with someone. Um. Does she have any friends? No, actually. Nobody really likes her, except Scooter. Scooter's okay with her. Even Connor the Sixth isn't that fond of her, though. Which, oh, is a bit sad. Well, don't worry. Like, we're guaranteed she's going to have a husband because somebody made one to and put them on him on the exchange. So I'm going to download him once she's old enough. I'll introduce them. It'll be like an arranged marriage. Um, He'll come over. He'll promise them, like, I don't know. A textile factory and a flock of sheep and um, in exchange 
They will give him their daughter, Connor the Seventh. Oh no, what's happened to the cherry tree? It seems to have died in the couple of minutes that I wasn't looking. <laughs> Crap. Okay, sim gardening is really not my thing, I guess. That happened really quickly, though. I didn't, uh, I didn't expect that. Oh my god, and woodworking doesn't seem to be Connor the Seventh's thing. She's at level 5 handiness, and she's still whacking herself in the face with the hammer. And do your homework. You'll need to have that done for tomorrow. I don't want her to fall behind in school just because she's learning to be some sort of awesome mechanic woman. So, um, yeah, she better get it out of the way. Look, Connor the Seventh, Connor the Sixth is distracting her. Connor the Sixth, I think you need to go and be mean to someone. Um, and here's a target. Here's a prime target. Haley Monroe. Come on, let's go make her life hell. Did you see that? She just kind of phased into her costume. That's spooky. Hello, Haley. You must be new around here. Everyone else gives this house a wide berth, like this guy. Um, what's his name? Andrew Hildebrand, who seems to be walking towards the edge of that cliff over there just to avoid passing the house. You should do the same. Let's insult her face. It is an unusual face. There he goes, he went over the edge. No, Andrew, don't. You've so much to live for. Let's chew her out. Arr! I imagine that's what it is. It, she's like just going to start chewing her with her teeth. There's blood, there's gnashing, then she's just like, Ah, oh, please, stop biting me, you random woman. Um, oh, are they having a fight? Let's beat her up. She doesn't look like she can fight. No, they're chatting. Why aren't... Oh, there we go. Let's mock her outfit while we're at it. Oh, no, she won. How, how could you win, Haley? How could you win? Get out of here. Well, actually, hang on. Before you go, I want to... Um, declare you my enemy. Connor the Seventh is making an awful lot of enemies. And I approve. I, I quite like this. That, and that takes us to 100% of her daily meanness done. Perfect. The quote has been reached. Uh, have a nice day, Haley. Um, my work here is done. <laughs> I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you later. Anytime, Haley. Anytime. Let's go in and watch the action channel. See what's going on. What kind of action films The Sims get. What's this? Oh. It's night time. There's some eyes. Oh, it's something about a werewolf, I think. Oh, cool. It's like um, an American werewolf in London or something. But it's not in London. It looks like uh, Sim City. An American werewolf in Sim City. And friends. And it's over. That was a bloody short film, I have to say. Um... And I mean, I don't like films out li living their welcome, but that was ridiculous. Oh, and there's something else now. Something about a house on fire. It's, um, Fire Squad, starring Richard Dean Anderson and Meryl Streep. Oh, she doesn't seem to be enjoying it. She's like, oh no, she's cheering along and thinking of motorbikes. That's the best reaction you can get from a TV show. It makes you cheer and think of motorbikes. Um... I've seen that mentioned in many reviews. Well, look, that's been a good bit of progress now. My voice is starting to go again, so I think I'm going to wrap it up. But Connor the Seventh has been promoted to getaway driver, which is good. She's got her mind on motorbikes and everything. It's good. Sorry, that was Connor the Sixth. Connor the Seventh is learning DIY, and she's doing quite well at it. Soon she'll be able to open the mysterious hatch, and we'll see what treasures are hidden beneath. And everyone else is just kind of doing their thing, as usual. So, um, I guess I'll see you next time. Goodbye.